Hey guys, this is Production Music Live with a short um, tutorial today about mastering. If you master a track, it's so important um, to have a reference track to which you can compare your work. Um, but you should technically be able to switch between your track and the reference track very fast. So for those purposes there are plugins on the market but there are several other ways to do this in Ableton and I want to show you how I do it. I like to master my tracks in my projects so I can quickly adjust things. This is a little uh, remix I made just for fun and I'm going to play a few seconds for you. So now I have my um, mastering plugins um, on the master chain and this track over here is the reference track. It's by the way a template we made so check out the link in the description for that one. So if I solo this track now it goes through my mastering chain as well so I can't AB those two songs without affecting the reference uh, track as well. So what I, what I do is, I create an audio track, name it pre-master, then I'm selecting all the other tracks of the song and choose a new output, so it's not the master but the pre-master. So now all those tracks are going through this pre-master. Now what I have to do is um, just taking those uh, those plugins and pasting them into the pre-master song. If I'm playing this track now, you won't hear nothing because first you have to um, press this button here, in. So now I can switch between uh, my track and the, uh, the reference track really quick. So I hope you liked this tutorial, subscribe to our channel, visit us on productionmusiclive.com and hope to see you next time. Bye.